What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. We are the Distorted Theorists, and we are here to talk. What, what? I know you're excited. I'm just laughing at you. You get all hooked up with a Star Wars related. I, I don't know what it is. I was like, what did I do? I didn't do something no, wrong. We good. are here to talk about the trailer that was released today for The Acolytes, <laughs> the upcoming live action, which is apparently supposed to be what they're considering to be the more adult and mature Ooh, series. And, uh, Disney Plus? On the. <laughs> 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 but Peter, yeah, before you, you before, realize we're gonna have to pay. I, I listen, that. I know you're hyped up. I know you're hyped up. But before we get into any of this, as always, if you want to support the channel, and we do appreciate it, if you would hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and sit back and listen to this guy gosh about Star Wars. Peter, Star Wars, what Star is Wars, that Star like? Because Star Star Wars, Star Wars. I'm just an so, average movie watcher. You're the you're the fan. So tell me what we're expecting here. I, I haven't paid much attention to a lot of uh like the the finer details of it because I kind of want to go into it being like fresh. Surprised. Yeah. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. I do know that it's supposed to take place near the end of the High Republic era, which is before, about 100, 200 years before we're seeing what uh, episode one, The Phantom Menace, would have been. Oh, so this is like before the, the main We're not, nine seeing, we're not seeing Skywalkers or no? anything like that. No, nothing like that. No, like probably, well, I guess there wouldn't even be Darth, Men Darth Vader mentioned at that point. Oh, God, no. There, right? there, there, there might be something relating to... Uh, um, the, pro uh, the prophecy for uh, one will be born right. will bring balance to the light and the dark, all that stuff. Um, there was a rumor many moons ago that this was going to be about the rise of power of Palpatine uh, under Master Sifo-Dyas. Not sifo um, Someone's going to roast me in the comments <laughs> for it. Um, but uh, but there, I don't even know any of the cast. I know there was someone that was at uh, uh, Star Will there Wars be Celebration. Jedi and stuff. Yes, did we because, assume? Oh, okay. So this is this the, the High Republic era was generally like the Golden Age. The Sith were not even in the picture. There was nothing. There were other evils that they were dealing with. But this was like the Golden Age of the Jedi. The Jedi were very much respected. Uh, in so no Revan. That, no, this again, was this much is, after Revan. This was oh. th like tens of thousands of oh, years after Oh, Revan. so Old Republic is way before oh, this. yeah, okay. like four or five thousand years. So, uh, just basing off that and basing off the title and et cetera, who, what does the Acolyte mean and contribute to Star Wars? What, why that title? The Acolyte is basically, it, it's the definition of Acolyte, I'm pretty sure, and again, someone wrote this, is oh, you're, 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 you're new, you're the, um, you're really good at what you're doing. <laughs> kind of thing. Like it's okay, okay. And so, so obviously someone's showing promise, and then I guess it's going to be the maybe they're going to be on the light or the dark oh. side. If this is a Palpatine thing, who's to say? And which is a common trope in Star Wars, but I mean it works. You don't, you don't, you don't take away and change anything that works. Is tried and true. My thing is, is Star Wars has had a rough go, but really and truly, um, when it comes to the movies uh, with the sequel, the the sequel sequel trilogy, um, it was a rough go. Don't get me wrong, I enjoyed the movies. I'm enjoying everything that's coming out about Star Wars. There's the Clone Wars, there's Bad Batch. Rebel Moon was dope. What? No. What's, what, the one in between? Nope, Rebel Moon, nope. Nope, wait. Nope, that's oh, wait. Different... <laughs> oh, no, I messed up. What's the one in between? Rogue One. Rogue One, that was it. Oh, Rebel Moon my God. is a Zack you Snyder know, directed ha, film. You can roast me in the comments, finally, for once, please. I was actually speechless. No, for Rogue that. One, Rogue One. I knew it started with Rogue, Rogue One. Was dope. Rogue One was dope. But, like, the Bad Batch, Clone Wars, all that, Obi Wan, like, I did enjoy them, but it just didn't have that same level of, like, oh, I don't think this is what Disney wants to see with, um, with Star Wars. But where this is uh, supposed to be a little bit more mature, mm. uh, more adult, more dramatic, as opposed to like I'm hello there, like well, all that stuff. Well, I did see in the poster uh, that they released when they when you told me the trailer dropped and you got all mm. excited. There was like blood or something in it. So I yeah, I looked at that, see, but I didn't. Yeah. I don't know the symbol, the symbolic meaning of that. It could just be blood. It could be rust. It could be just something, or it could be relating to the main character of whom I don't know who the main character is. Well, guess what? There's, we only, watch there's only one way to find out. So let's get into the trailer reaction for Disney Plus's The Acolyte right now. Let's get it. Close Aww. your eyes. Look at that thing. Your eyes. Can this so again, so the younglings, before they become Jedi, Padawans. I yeah. We must not trust them. Okay, which is a tenet of force. Tell me what comes into your mind. Okay, so this, I, maybe this is not during filming, this is before their... Life. 
for Island. Star Wars stuff. Like even the world building is just so. I see dope, fire. Right? I see fire. Oh, oh that's a carry him up, Trinity. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, been a force. Oh, who's that? Assassin. Okay. Jew. Someone is killing right. Jedi. That's not even that far away. Killing makes sense. Jedi. Oh, Wookiee! What happened? I sensed darkness. Oh, I know him. Bro, this looks like some of that old Japanese yeah, style fighting. Cool. Like film. Talking about the yeah, right. a little bit. This isn't about good or bad. This is about power. And who is allowed to okay. use it? I don't know. And who is that? Is that? I don't know. Oh, that's a red that's saber. That's not good. Are they gonna show who it is? Whoever they're not. Oh, fuck. Like you say, it could be June Palpatine. No, no. It's probably his master. That was actually dope. Oh my god. That was god. a dope Darth, trailer. Darth Play just the wise. Darth Play just the wise. I'm wondering if that's who it is. As like an introduction on screen for the first time? Well, he... technically, he's been mentioned before. Has anyone ever told you about the tragedy of Darth Plagueis the Wise? No, no. Enlighten us. Please, stick around. Listen to it this. It was in episode talk. three. It was in Revenge of the Sith. Okay, go ahead. Oh, well, he what was the story? He, he found the secret to bring someone back to life, supposedly. And then the only person that he taught it to was his apprentice. Which is Palpatine. Yeah, and he killed him. So it didn't work till so Hot Born did it. Oh, shit. So this is what I'm wondering if this is We might going see to be... the seeds of that. Like well, the... this is the thing. Remember what I said? This was the height of Jedi, and they're saying that Jedi are being yeah. killed. Why are they being killed? And then someone does this, so the Sith have not revealed themselves. The Sith go into hiding forever. Okay. So I know you said this takes like place years before episode one, and like totally don't notice myself. Maybe you can shed some light. So these Sith... Lords, I guess is what we'll call them. Um, how long can they live for? Like, would this be Palpatine in this show and well, last 200 years? Like, what, what are we thinking? It depends okay. because there's all these rumors and everything that were going around because it says that Palpatine was so powerful in the Force, even though he was represented by Ian McDiarmid and he had the old, like, mm -hmm. I'm a fatherly figure. Yep, yep. He was actually using the Force to mask himself and he was doing oh, it so and that's why he goes all... That's why he's all, like, feeble yeah. later. Right. Now... That's, you know, that's a whole thing. One thing I want to touch on, maybe, and maybe I missed something in one of, I mean, there's so many episodes and, and there's TV shows and just games and stuff and the mm -hmm. lore just stretches, but uh, General Snoke from episode yeah. seven and on, where did he ever come from? And like, is there a chance Pretty he sure may ever he is there, they is confirmed that he was a failed clone of Palpatine. Ah, uh, that makes sense to someone think, like And maybe. again, if I'm wrong. Let's have a discussion. I love it. I yeah. love to talk about Star Wars. Not Rebel Moon. Not Rebel Moon. Um, they're allowed to come for me in the comments. This one, please. They'll still come me. for me. It's anyway. fine. Somehow <laughs> they will come for me. But what do you think? Are you excited for it? Are you ready to watch it? Yes. Uh, the the effects didn't look so hot when that ship was shown breaking apart on the ice mm. and everything like that. It looked mm -hmm. a bit rough. But again, mm -hmm. it's a TV show. But I'm not watching it for the effects. I'm watching it for the Jedi. But like, I don't know. I was watching it. It was very, I mean, it, dun, 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 yeah, it was dun, like Carrie Ann Moss, Carrie Ann Moss, whatever. But Matrix, it was like she would have one hand behind. She was but like, dun, 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 dun. that's Part right? of it. No, that's it was dope. That. That's what I'm I saying. Know. I liked it. That's great right? because it's not just going like, like if you watch a soap opera. Agree. Agree. Did you watch? A no, I didn't. But I want you to tell me. Where there's I a lot have. more hand to hand because that's what she was trained in. Uh, so there's a lot more of that, and that is essentially because again, what we see of the Jedi is that there are basically the warriors and in. the generals in this in the Clone Wars, and they're always bringing out their lightsaber to do it. But that's not. They don't want to do that. The tenet of the Jedi is not to attack. They right. wait to be attacked to defend themselves. So that's why uh, that whole and she just gives them a shove. Yeah, back, just like back off. Yeah, 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 yeah. They will defend themselves if necessary. That is one of the main uh, things okay. of the Jedi. They are there to defend. They are to defend others that cannot defend themselves. I know that's something from friggin' the Avengers as well, but. Yeah. That's part of it. They're not to be like, because if they do attack, they are either considered a gray Jedi because they're in between, or they're fall, they're a fallen Jedi, uh, or like the if they're taken holder. on, not really. Yeah, okay. You try. It's, okay. <laughs> it's, it's good. Yeah. Um, I'm or, helping. Or you're a Sith with an apprentice because 
thousands of years ago in the Old Republic, there were Sith warriors. Mm. Like there were Jedi Knights. But then the lore on this, like the Star Wars lore just keeps building and building and going deeper. And the thing is, it's almost like they never dilute. It's like always something that adds a little more flesh mm. to but what still stays George, the same. Lu uh, George Lucas, yes, yeah. please say I'm right on that, uh, is, you know, has, has built, right? Mm. And anything that's fleshed out, like sometimes it get tedious and they're like, oh my God, they're doing another this and another that. But I have yet to hear even yourself or anyone online really watch something besides Solo that they did not like. I like this like Ahsoka, Ahsoka and uh, what was the other one? Um, Andor and the one before that. There was another one. Obi-Wan? Yeah, that was it. I mean, it just keeps, the hits are coming. So, I mean, it's a great time they're to be a Star Wars out, fan. There just needs to be more stuff in the Star Wars universe that isn't necessarily Jedi. Space Wizards, mm. like that was what mm. Andor was about the whole thing. But I would just like to be like, uh, I would like to see a mockumentary. I would like to see a show about stormtroopers mm. and like what they're going through and everything. Like, yeah, but are they the baddies? <sighs> Had a rough day. Smoking their death stick <laughs> on, the, on, the, on the the bridge of an imperial star destroyer and just being like, oh, it's like the office. Like that would be cool to see. It doesn't need to be like <laughs> one <laughs> the whole time. I just like to be like. Some lighthearted looking <laughs> dream. Yeah. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining us for our trailer reaction and whatever that was uh, for the Acolyte on Disney Plus Star Wars coming June, which June. is only so a few two months episode away. June 4th. That's dope. That's yeah. dope. Uh, as always, if you want to support the channel, we always appreciate it if you join us and help us grow. If you would hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Come for me about Star Wars stuff. Do it. <laughs> yeah, write him Star Wars stuff. He loves to write you guys back. So we always appreciate it. And with that, I am the real Jossie. I am, I don't know who I am today. Anyways, <laughs> like we always like to say around here, keep it real. Whatever it is, keep it real. <laughs>